What's good, everybody? The voice of the WGC back in the building. You know, we have to get them 2K videos out the way. Let's get back to the AW videos. So, a little update on Fight Forever. I went ahead, took the time to go through all of these retailers, and so far, nobody has 331 still except Best Buy, as you can see. So, also, fun fact. Guess who I just got off the phone with? La Champion. Nah, I'm joking. <laughs> I just got off the phone with Best Buy. And here's where the conversation went. So I called them. And I asked them, have they heard about a game called AW Fight Forever? They look in the database. And she says, oh, I found it. I asked, what's the release date? She says, March 31st. So I'm like, okay. I asked her, is this a placeholder or what? She says, this is not a placeholder. This is a real day. I'm scratching my head and I'm in completely complete disbelief because I still don't believe this, bro. I'm, I refuse to get my hopes up. But she says, March 31st. So I try to go more in depth. I'm like, okay. I ask again. To clarify, just to make sure, I'm like, so when can I start playing this game? She says, March 31st, once again. So, as the phone call is about to end, she says, if you want to, I can, you know, receive your payment. And you could pick up your game and start playing on March 31st. So, I'm like, okay. Best Buy is committed to this game releasing on March 31st, but still, still, still. Who gave you the green light for this game to drop out March 31st? And why are you the only retailer that's saying this game is coming out on March 31st? I haven't seen anything from GameStop, nothing from AW, Tony Khan, Walmart, Sony, Microsoft, Target. I haven't seen nothing from nobody except y'all. But then, the homie that released the screenshot of his pre-order being updated. He dropped another gem yesterday. He says. That Will Washington of the Grab City Podcast. Revealed that AW has filmed promotional material. Featuring talents from the AW Fight Forever console game. That will be showcased soon. Centered around the Best Buy release date potentially. So what this means. Is that AW. Potentially. Filmed a brand new trailer for AW Fight Forever. That could have. A release date. They could possibly be the Best Buy release date too. Or it could just be a random release date. And. Once again. Here at Unsanction TV. We keep it a stack. We keep it real. A lot of people. They like. To talk about the message. They like to discuss the message. But they don't want to give no shout out to the one who delivered the message first. So. He said Will Washington of the Grab City Podcast. Here we go. And here's his podcast. There we go. We give credit over here, man. And a lot of y'all gotta start doing that. Don't be on that lame ass shit trying to showcase everybody's content, but not give nobody credit. Y'all gotta stop that, bro. Real talk. But, yeah. So let's continue. And I'm sitting here and I'm like, okay, this has gotta be a prank, right? But then I remember, and some of you might remember this too. You go back to last year, full gear. What are we supposed to get? We were supposed to get an AEW Fight Forever trailer. But what happened? It got leaked. I was just chilling. It was 2 a.m. And then I see PlayStation, AEW Fight Forever gameplay trailer. I'm like, okay, uh, it's, it's too late. I'm, I got to be tripping. I, I gotta get some sleep. So I click on it. And it's an actual trailer. It got leaked. It got leaked early. So to make sure. I wait. I watch full gear. From start to finish. And this is what they showed. This is what they showed. This is what got posted on the AW pages too. So that makes me think. What if they got caught slipping again? And Best Buy beat them to the punch with their release date. 
That could be the case. Who knows? Maybe. So, this is what I suggest. I suggest that you settle down, don't get your hopes up, and wait till AW Revolution. Because if they filmed something about the game, if they filmed a new trailer about the game, and this game is supposedly dropping on March 31st, you would think that they would showcase this at the pay-per-view, the upcoming pay-per-view, Revolution. So once again, this is the key date. If you don't see anything at Revolution, give it a rest. Alright? If you don't see anything at Revolution, hey, no need to get your hopes up. Just drop it right there. So this is the key date to look out for. Revolution. And also, another thing, I'm sorry to keep on going back and back and back, but let's look at this again too. So this game just dropped. We said, what did we say? Week 4. This game just came out on the 24th. That's week 4. The planogram says to hold AW Fight Forever till April. The game says this game drops on March 31st. So what does that mean? I'm, I'm going to show you once again. The planogram said to hold this game till week 4. This game just came out on the 24th. This game right here. And it says hold AW Fight Forever until April. Hold for April. So what is what could that possibly mean? And this coming out on March 31st. Let's go to the calendar. One. March 31st. What comes after March 31st? April. But one thing that I'm scared of. I'm not going to lie, bruh. What comes after March 31st? April 1st. And what is April 1st? April Fool's Day. So I'm not going to lie, bruh. I'm not going to lie. What about all this is a prank? Like I said, my expectations are below sea level. I'm not trying to get my hopes up, bruh. Like I wanted as much as I wanted, as much as I wanted, and as good as it's looking, the things are starting to line up. I do not want to get too excited just to get stabbed in the back again, bruh. But, hey, we'll see. Like I said, be on the lookout for Revolution next week and we will see if AEW is ready to stop bullshitting and release Fight Forever but anyways that about wraps it up for the video don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share and most importantly hit that bell what you doing? we out here one love, God bless. See you the next one. Peace. I hope each and every one of y'all have an amazing weekend.